Did you think the quesadillas couldn't be healthy? Today, I'm gonna prove you wrong. Let's get started making some delicious, healthy alternative quesadillas. First and foremost, you're gonna to wanna to buy the healthiest flour tortillas you can find. The most important thing is to avoid tortillas with hydrogenated oils, which translates to trans fat. It's good to avoid as many preservatives as possible as well. At your health food store, you can find some tortillas with really clean ingredients. However, these tortillas aren't that pliable. Alternatively, if you get some with a little bit of oil and a couple preservatives, they will be more pliable. A third excellent option is if you don't mind making the tortillas, this is gonna be the best and healthiest option. Lightly brush avocado oil on one side of the tortilla. Place the tortilla oil side down in a heated pan. Add half of one serving of a quality Mexican cheese, preferably low fat, to half of the tortilla. Now we're gonna load up these tortillas with lots of plant food ingredients. This is what makes it much healthier. While you can choose whatever veggies you want or even cook some fajita veggies, what I'm going to be adding is red onion, tomato, jalapeno, cilantro, and black beans. Black beans are my protein source here, but you can alternatively add chicken if you'd like. Now top with the remaining cheese. Cook until your cheese is melted and the tortilla is a golden brown. Fold the quesadilla and cook a little longer to make the cheese adhere to both sides. Now it's done. Cut the quesadilla with a pizza cutter and then serve with avocado, salsa, more cilantro if you'd like, a lime wedge if you'd like, and I love to use plain non-fat Greek yogurt as a low-fat sour cream substitute. Enjoy! I hope you now know that it's possible to make healthier quesadillas. Sometimes you just gotta eat less of it or beef it up with some healthy ingredients. I hope you find these super tasty. Let us know what you thought in the comments, and I will see you soon.